What I'm about to show you can make you a lot of money. This right here is AI technology. It's moving at such a fast pace that if you don't catch up, you will be left behind. Now, a lot of this stuff I'm about to show you is cringy. I ain't gonna lie to you. But if you use it right, again, it can make you a lot of money. So without further ado, check this out. Yo, so what you're looking at on the screen right now is an AI human, all right? So this guy is not real. I know he looks real. He not real, all right? You go here. This girl here is not real. The people in these, in these photos are not real. And the following is huge. 2.6 million AI influencers, all right? They're, they're getting big. This girl here is not a real woman at all. AI influencers. And they're actually getting sponsorship deals from diff big brands. Crazy, right? So how are people doing this stuff? All right, so you come over here to Leonardo.ai. All right, this website right here, you can generate as many images as you want to. So boom, I'm just, matter of fact, I'll go here and I'll show you. Let's go down here because you could build cartoons on here. You could do whatever you want. This woman here is not real. This is a AI generated. So you can do this and do so much with it, y'all. I'll let y'all brains go uh, to what you can do. But as you see, all of these realistic people on here are not real people. This guy here is AI generated. This black lady next to him, AI generated. All right. I'll even show you some of the ones I've done. So whenever you come here, you'll get 150 credits for free per day. Uh, and they'll let you come in here and generate. So you go to image generator. OK. And then you type in whatever you want your person to look like. You can say a 25 year old male, female, whatever, long hair, curly, whatever outfit, whatever environment you want them in. And it'll create it uh, for you. You can also add negative prompts. Uh, usually I do things like on negative prompts, meaning like you don't want no distortions or no cross eyes or nothing like that. So I'll show you some of the people I've generated. I generated this guy, uh, this black lady, uh, this guy here. Some of these look a little cartoonish because I'm trying to work them out. Uh, but I've generated a lot of people. So I'll click load all mine and you'll just be able to see all of the different people that I've generated. Look at this crazy. So you can make like gaming characters and stuff like that for, you know, however you want to do it, tell stories with it. Uh, but it gets crazier than this, y'all. It gets crazier. And I'll even show you that I was I was even animated uh, one of my characters that I made. So you can animate your pictures. That's uh, somebody that I actually uh, created and then I generated. I'm trying to see if I can find them. So I created this image and then I was able to animate the image. Uh, as well. You can animate it even further than this, which I'll get into is is insane. But um, you can use this to create faceless YouTube channels, faceless Instagram channels. If you don't want to show your face and stuff like that, and you want to be able to have this stuff. And I'll give you an example right now. So let me show you this. This is a girl who is creating these and her YouTube channel is now, I think, at around 54,000 subs, but she's creating these. Right. So I'll mute that so you can just kind of see what it looks like. But this is her character. She's using that faceless YouTube channel. Right. There's another guy here. He's this is a this is an AI character. Right. And he has him talking. He get these edits done on Fiverr.com. Get your videos edited on there if you want to. Or you can edit them yourself in CapCut, uh, which is what I use. But if you want to use Fiverr as well, you can get, hire a video editor. They can edit all your stuff up. You just create your character over here and then you know, animate it. I'll show you how to animate them uh, with the mouth and stuff like that. Another thing you can do with this um, is, you know, I don't know if y'all familiar with Bible projects. So if you want to tell Bible stories, create your own characters, uh, you could do that. So look, these different kind of animations, you can kind of create these um, with photos and stuff like that. Uh, all of this kind of stuff you'll be able to do. Uh, as you can see, this channel is for me and sub. So a lot of these, uh, you know, channels are using this kind of stuff uh, to their advantage. All right. So this is one particular website. Whenever you do image generation, you can come to chat GBT and you could just type in, make me a prompt of a photorealistic 22 year old black guy standing in a room with LED lights and stuff like that. Uh, and then they gave me this prompt. So all you would do is just copy this prompt. And this is if you can't think of, you know, your own prompts for yourself, just paste that prompt in there and then I generate, okay? And you can add so much more stuff to your photo to make it even more realistic. 
Uh, but whatever you put in here, that's what they try to generate and they do it fairly quickly, you know? So boom, this is what they gave me. Look how crazy that is, right? And if you want them to look even more realistic, you can add more stuff in there. Uh, if you want more characters, all you have to do is go to, you could do four, I could do eight, but I'll do four. Let's say I do four and I generate again. All right, and then they'll generate me four. Now, if you want them to look more consistent, characters because sometimes they'll look different you can add a name so say 25 year old Gerard or something like that and then they'll make the consistent character so they all look alike but you could do that uh they have a whole lot more see you could tell some of these look uh different but super dope stuff right you could create forex faceless youtube channels like i was saying and you can create your own characters whatever however you want to do it or whatever kind of channel you want uh, instagram whatever and the sky's the limit with this kind of stuff all right so it's a lot more you could do with it as well but we'll we'll move on okay so artflow.ai is another website that you can come to right and you can create consistent characters as well so i just typed in 27 year old black man standing on a mansion balcony and this is what it generated right just from me using a prompt right look at this look how realistic this looks it looks great right so they give you all of these different ones this is not a real person at all y'all what's so crazy about this is there's another website and it's called runway all right so runway let me just show you what i did i actually turned this image that i created on artflow.ai and i made it into a small video four second video using runway and all you have to do is upload that image and it'll make you a video look at this boom Got them animated, right? Kind of changed his look, but I think you can add more prompts and better prompts to make it, you know, work. But the fact that they just turned this image into a video, you can use that for B-roll, little clips here and there if you wanted to tell a story. Insane what AI is doing right now. All right, so if you want to know, you come to the runwayml.com. All right, let me go back to the dashboard. Uh, you'll go to start generating whatever image you have on your computer you can actually whatever image you got so if you generated an image from leonardo or artflow all right you just go to the runway you upload it you find it you click that image and then just hit generate and it'll make a video out of that image right and you could do that multiple times if you want to tell a story uh and animate your characters which is absolutely insane y'all with canva if you want to like create cartoon characters or you want to like animate the mouths of the pictures that you generated on leonardo.ai you could do that all right so i'm just going to come here to one that i did of course because i showed you the other one i'll just show you how this here you could just animate the mouth so yeah i animated that uh you go down here First, you can go here to the side, type apps. We'll click apps, all right? And then once you do that, you wanna put in DID, right? DID, and this actually is an actual website that you can actually go to the official website, but I just use it on Canva uh, as well. So whatever image that you have, you can type in whatever you want it to say, or you can upload your own audio. So if you have like a, a iPhone or something, you wanna record an audio, you can upload your audio on here and then it'll have the picture, mouth, whatever it is you're saying, the eyes will be blinking and everything. So I'll show you, um, again, watch my eyes on this. See how his eyes is blinking? So you can either type in whatever you want him to say or you could do that. Or you can fully animate it, um, the video with the screens and all that if you wanna go to the, uh, the runway. Uh, so there's multiple different ways you can do this stuff, y'all. It's insane. All right, we're going to keep on rolling. So runway is good, too, as well, if you don't have an image, um, but you just want to type something in. So I just put mansion with the beach view, and this is what it generated for a video. I just, just simple, simple text. Look at that. They gave me a mansion with a beach view. No matter what I type in over here, it's going to generate it into a, a small video. So imagine the kind of B-roll you can have or the kind of stories you can tell uh, when you could just dream up something and just put it on the screen. Insane, right? This stuff can be used for good. It also can be used for evil. You know what I'm saying? So use it for good. Come on now. All right, 
Remaker. So if you are wondering, like, this is called Remaker.ai. If you are wondering how people are getting these videos and these reels, right? Because how do you got a fake AI, right? But you're able to do videos and stuff like that, right? You're able to have people spinning balls and being active and doing all this craziness, right? So you come on over here to Remaker.ai and you can face swap. So you could take an image that you generated and, and put it on somebody else's body, right? It's, it's just freaking crazy, right? Don't even know what you would use this kind of stuff for, but it's a million things you could use it for uh, if you figure it out. Write in the comment section what you would use some of this stuff for. Uh, but you could take, and they give you examples. This is the original face. They swapped it with a different face, right? They swapped her face with a different face. And so... You know, you could do that. And so you could do video face swap to where I seen a guy that was uh, taking TikTok videos uh, of a girl working out. He made his own um, face on Leonardo.ai and he put his generated face onto that body. And then he was able to create his own, basically his own new human to where he can market or whatever with video and through pictures. So that's how they're creating all of these consistent uh pictures and stuff like that like because they're using somebody else's i guess body or something like that it's it's nuts y'all they able to be out with friends and all kind of stuff on social media it's just it's just insane i i'm like bro i don't even know it's yeah i'm lost for words y'all, as you can see because i'm like this is just nuts all right so that's what that one was for uh face swap so if you ever want to use that you can use that, you know what I'm saying, for whatever you can use it for. But please use it for good, you know what I'm saying, because we ain't got time for the Lord to be firing us up, you know what I'm saying. But it's out here, and you can make money off of it somehow, some way. All right, pick verse. This one is really dope, too. Uh, it's, it changes, um, basically creates videos out of images as well. Uh, but these videos are high quality. Like, this is not a real girl. This is not a real person. Just look at this. All of these are AI generated. Look how real this is. Insane the kind of stuff AI is doing right now. So use that to your own. You know, you come here, check this one out as well. Uh, really dope stuff. I mean, you can't make this stuff up. Now, this one right here is very cringy. This next one that I'm showing you, uh, this is Heijin. Heijin will allow you to clone yourself. We, yeah, yeah, my whole Illuminati conspiracy theory stuff popped up. But <laughs> this right here will allow you to clone yourself and basically have unlimited content across all social media platforms. So let me explain it. So basically, you can upload a video of yourself on here. They then make a clone of you, and it look directly like you, right? Sound like you, uh, all of that. Uh, and then you, they have a text to speech, so you can text whatever you want the AI to say, and it's gonna say it in your voice, and it'll mouth it just like you. Now it does look a little bit like AI when you compare it to yourself, but it looks just like you, exactly like you, a split image. Uh, and you can actually have your AI character clone. I mean, speak a different language. So if you put Spanish, he'll start speaking Spanish. You put Portuguese, they'll start speaking Portuguese or whatever. You know what I mean? insane stuff but this is what hey jen is they clone you uh uh so they're showing like the clone version of whoever this is so it'll look just like that they can put you in different environments um and it just look like you talking and it is very sinister <laughs> you know what i'm saying i ain't gonna lie to you but it can be used for good if you figure out a way to use it for good comment below again uh what some of this stuff can be used for all right so Let's get even more cringy, all right? 11labs.io. So I want y'all to listen to this. If you want to know how this AI thing works well, let me show you. Okay, first you need to go to leonardo.ai, find a character, then from there you go to... So that is not a real person, that is an AI voice. That is a voice clone. I actually cloned a voice and made it, I named it Black Girl Voice because I cloned a Black Girl's voice uh, and then made it my set, like, tweaked it in the settings to make up my own voice so it's not that person's voice because I was testing it just to see how crazy that is. But that is a cloned voice. But uh, the 11 Labs, you can, it's like text to speech, but you can use different voices. So they have all these different default templates on here. All these different names. These are all just AI generated people. 
with, with voices and you can type in whatever you wanted to say and it will say it. I actually pranked my daughter. Um, I had, <laughs> I made it sound like it was a voicemail. I pranked her and like, like, uh, like it was her school teacher calling and saying that she got in trouble for the day. She actually literally cried. You know what I'm saying? But I thought it was just a joke. But I was like, that's how crazy this stuff is. Like, it is nuts. But this type of stuff here, again, can be used for a many, a many different things uh, for good. I mean, there's a lot of different things you could do with real estate and all kind of stuff. And you just got to figure that out. Comment below again. Give us all ideas so we can all get to this bag. I'm just showing y'all because some of y'all think better than I do. So... Boom. All right. This is called magicstudio.com. All right. So this one here is you can erase anything out your picture with just eraser tools. So you can upload an image. It'll show you that. Like if you don't want cars in the driveway, you can remove that. You don't want people in your picture, you can remove that. So I just uploaded me a picture just so I can show you how this works. And I want to try to remove this TV. So I'm just going to do this real quick and then boom and then i'm gonna hit erase and let's see if it erases boom tv gone crazy ain't it just that quick boop so whatever i don't want in my picture i can take it out right insane so that's what that is this next one is called skybox.blockadelabs.com <laughs> you can see it right here, so you need to co uh, copy that. But this, you can basically type in whatever you want it to design, and it will design it for you in a matter of minutes. So this right here could definitely be good to sell to developers and stuff like that. Like, hey, if you like, hey, I got a project that I'm looking at, or I could sell this template or to clients or whatever. I don't know however they can use this, but you can use this for multiple ways. It'll create whatever kind of world you want, uh, whatever for your characters if you want to make cartoons with it or whatever. But I put in a modern design mansion with infinity pool. And what's so dope about this is you could just click and turn and it'll give you sky view. You can go up, you can go down into the pool. You can do 360 all the way around, right? Uh, and you could just look at your design. You know what I'm saying? How you want to design your house. You know what I mean? You're like, hey, I want it to look like this. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So this right here can be used for um, a number of different things, y'all. But again, all of this AI technology um, is here to stay, y'all. And you can make a lot of money with it. But hopefully this video uh, inspired you. I know it was a little creepy, but it's crazy. And just comment below how you use some of this stuff and I will see y'all in another video. Peace.